Hi, in this video we will see how to read a digital signal in LabVIEW. Um, for this, uh, we need a digital button. So here, uh, the LED which is already connected to the D3 pin of Lotus Kit. And I'm going to connect, uh, so here I have a push button. So this comes with the uh, Arduino basic kit uh, or static kit. So here I have a push button. I'm going to, uh, what I'm going to do in this tutorial is, whenever I press this push button, the LED has to go on. So I'm going to connect this push button to the digital pin 2. Oh. So I've connected the push button to the digital pin 2. Let's program it first and then we'll verify the program with our so Lotus Kit. Go to new, block diagram, structures, and while loop. Go make a hub. Then select the square account create control, go links, and initialize, close, and then go to peripherals, and I'm going to read a digital signal, and as well as write digital signal. So these are the blocks we need for this program. And the DI channel that I have connected for the read signal is uh, connected to the pin number 2. That's it. And the DI channel to write the signal is pin number 3. And the output of the read signal will be connected to the output value of the pin 3. So we have completed this program. All I have to do is to go to serial port. Right click, create, control, minimize it. So I need to control my, I need to connect my uh, Lotus Kit first. Uh, it is connected to my laptop. So I need to select the port that I have connected. It's connected in COM port 6. And I'm going to run this program. So the program has been running now. Let's verify this program. So whatever our objective is to, whenever this push button is turned pressed, so the LED needs to turn on. So here you can see, and I'm pushing this, the LED is turning on. So let's stop this program here. We also have another uh, component uh, comes with this uh, basic Arduino code. That this is called as a touch sensor. You can see here, instead of the uh, usual push button switch, we can use this touch sensor to uh, turn on and off a LED just by just by placing a hand here, we don't need to push any buttons for this. So I'm going to replace this uh, push button with attach sensor. So I've connected it. Again, I'm going to run this program to verify whether the touch sensor is working or not. So I'll run the program. I'm going to check. So here you can see. So whenever I press there or touch there, so it's just turning on. 
as you can see uh, general touch will make this LED go on off so this is how the touch sensor works and it's really cool and it's high sensitive so just placing my hand there it's turning on so that's it for this tutorial thanks for watching please subscribe to this channel thanks again